This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Well, Manny Fresh did an interview, and he says, I think he did it with Talib, and he said, I will never do another versus again, and I don't blame him, okay? He came ready to battle Scott Storch, and, you know, he had all these skits ready and everything, and, you know, a lot of people were telling him he went too far, and I was like, what? He's just being Manny Fresh. Manny Fresh has always been funny, a little goofy, but very talented. And he was just bringing a little competition and a little spirit to the verses. But people were saying he was going too far against Scott Storch and everything. And that's like the butterfly generation. Everybody should do a kumbaya all the time. It's like, come on, man. Okay. People can't take uh, competition anymore. You know, and it's just crazy. You even saw with the Gucci man in Jeezy thing. Gucci man went too far. Well, Jeezy was part of encouraging people to go after his chain in 2005, and it resulted in someone almost taking Gucci man's life, okay? Uh, luckily, Gucci man was able to protect himself, and a lot of people were affected by that. So it's kind of hard to, say, you know, let things go. And bygones be bygones when someone was trying to take you out, in a way, you know, like indirectly. Uh, Manny Fresh, if you have a beat battle, you have a, if you have a battle, just, you know, like a, any kind of battle in hip hop is competition. They used to have B-boy battles, MC battles. They still have those. Shout out to Smack. He keeps that alive. Okay. And a lot of other places. And, you know, uh, they have these DJ battles where, you know, producers are playing their beats. Manny Fresh started that. Uh, a while back, okay, Swiss Beats and Just Blaze did one a long time ago, and then uh, Manny Fresh has done a bunch of them with uh, DJ Toom, Just Blaze, he had the Beat Summit. Big, okay? And now, Swiss Beats and Timbaland, they did it, and then they decided to turn it into something, and it's good. You know, they're making all the money, but it's good, okay? Also, I wouldn't do it again because he didn't get paid, and everybody's getting paid now, you know? There should be some back pay for the other guys who set it up for it to be what it is today. Anyways, the whole versus thing is getting a little tired. I like the Gucci Man and Jeezy one, and that's what it should be. It should be two guys that are in competition with each other. You know, the, the, we need the smack talking everything and make sure nothing happens at it, but it has to be competition. Um, then we got... Mike Tyson. Now, Mike Tyson was accused by you God of uh, taking his mom's earrings when he was younger. So when you God was eight, Mike Tyson was a teenager. Supposedly, he took uh, you God's mom's earrings. And Mike Tyson recently said, well, if I did do that and you feel like I did it, I'll write you a check for it. I can afford to pay you back for it. I was a little reckless back then. I don't know if I did this, but you know what? I'll pay your mom for the earrings. That's that's honorable. Okay, Mike Tyson was a savage at one point. A lot of people are, you know, like when you're just trying to make it, and you got you're covered up in bad circumstances. That does not a recipe for a great uh, mental health, you know, mental, you know, just having a great mental capacity. Mike Tyson's had to do a lot of work to be where he's at today, and he's an incredible human being, uh, as we know. You know, I don't know if you watch his podcast and everything, but Mike Tyson is amazing. You know, he has his demons like everybody, but he's just such an interesting person um and you got i mean i'm sure you didn't take it personally you just that's crazy right that's a crazy story uh anyways guys this is jordan tower with jt news i appreciate you guys and i will check you guys in the next one um i hope you guys are having a great day today and relaxing and getting ready for the week i'll check you guys in the next one this is jordan tower with jt news make sure you smash that like button peace